بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ویلکم ٹو مائی نیو لاک کلاس سو ٹوڈے وی ول ڈسکس اباؤٹ دی نان اوپیائڈس اینالجیسکس اور اینٹی انفلیمیٹری اینالجیسکس سو موسٹ اینٹی انفلیمیٹری اینالجیسکس دے آر ڈیرائڈ فرام تھری کمپاؤنڈس ڈسکورڈ ان نائنٹین سائنچری دا فرسٹ ون ایز سیلی سیلیک ایسڈ دا سیکنڈ ون ایز پائرازولونس اینڈ دا تھرڈ ون ایز پیناسیٹینس اور اور انادر نیم آف پیناسیٹین دیٹ ایز ایسیٹو پینیٹیڈینس آلدو کیمیکلی آن ریلیٹڈ دا ڈرگس اینڈ دیز فیملیز ہیو دی ایبیلیٹی ٹو ریڈیو مائلڈ ٹو ماڈریٹ فین تھرو ایکشن دیٹ ریڈیوس انفلمیشنس ایٹ ایٹ سورس سیلی سیلیک ایسیڈس کیونکہ دے اسٹرکچر آف سیلی سیلیک ایسڈ سیلی سیلیک ایسڈ ہیز اے کیمیکل فارمولا ہے سی سیون ایچ سکس او تھری سو دی نمبر آف کاربن ایٹم وچ از پریزنٹ اینڈ اسٹرکچر آف دی سیلی سیلیک ایسڈ دیٹ از کاربن سیون ہائیڈروجن سیکس اینڈ دی نمبر آف آکسیجن ایٹم دیز آر تھری سیلی سیلیک ایسڈس ایٹ از کلر لیس کریسٹلائن آرگینک ایسڈ سیلی سیلیک as a medication which is used most commonly to help to remove the outer layer of the skin. As such, it is used to treat warts. Warts are typically small, round and hard growths that are similar in color to the rest of the skin. Psoriasis. Psoriasis is a long-lasting autoimmune disease characterized by the patches of abnormal skin and these skin patches are typically red, itchy and scaly. Dandruff, acne, ringworm, dermatophytosis is also known as ringworm and a fungal infection of skin. So I mean that salicylic acid used in the variety of conditions, especially in dermatophytosis and skin disorders. These drugs are very effective, especially they are used to treat skin disorders or dermatological disorders. This is the second one group, which is called Firezolones. Firezolone, the drug of these families, have the ability to reduce mild to moderate pain through the action that reduce inflammation at its source. This is the structure of Firezolone. And this one is five fires alone. Look at the structure and structure activity relationships, so the number of atoms, so they are different. The third one is penacetines. Penacetines are acetopenatidines. It is another pain relieving and fever reducing drug which was widely used between its introduction in 1887 and the 1983 pain imposed by the US Food and Drug Administration and this is the structure of penicetines look at here structure activity relationships so the number of atom which is present this is the chemicals formula Now, what is the mode of action or mechanism of action of penicetine? Penicetine, basically, this is analgesic. It has analgesic effects, which is due to the action on the sensory tract of the spinal cord. In addition, penicetine has a depressant action on the heart, where it acts as a negative inotrop. Here, the word which is used, inotrop, what does it mean? Inotrop, basically, the medicines which change the force of your heart contractions. You know there are two types of inotropes. The first one is positive inotropes and the second one is negative inotropes. And positive inotropes, we are studying about the uh, strength, which strength the pores of the heart. When the force when the strength of force of contraction of heart become increases a strong contraction of the hearts while in negative inotropes it weaken the force of the heart beat when the force of the 
the force of the contraction of the heart becomes decreases in negative inotropes while the force of contraction of heart increases and becomes strong due to positive inotropic effect. It is an antipyretic acting on the brain to decrease the temperature set point and it is also used to treat rheumatoid arthritis. Rheumatoid arthritis, which is a long-term autoimmune disorder, it primarily affects the joints and it typically results in warmth, swollen and painful joints. It is metabolized in the body to paracetamols, which is also called acetaminophen, which is also a clinically relevant analgesics. Now come towards salicylic acid derived use. So acid is acetyl salicylic acid or aspirin, which is derived from a salicylic acid, is the most widely used mild analgesics. It is considered the prototype for anti-inflammatory analgesics. So as we have already discussed, the different uh, analgesic drugs which are used to relieve for pain sensation, how to relieve the pain sensations. Now the second one is penicetine's derivatives. So acetaminophen is a derivative of penicetine. Acetaminophen is the derivative of penicetine, while acetyl salicylic acid or aspirin is derived from the salicylic acid. So this is clear. Acetaminophen is a derivative of penicetine and the uh, aspirin-like drugs are non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drug which include the compounds such as ibuprofen, naproxen and phenoprofenes. So all these drugs come under the category of what and said non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drug. Look at here, this is uh, ibuprofenes, tablet USP 200 mg, pain reliever, fever reducers 300 caplets. These are naproxen gastro-resistance tablet. Now, firozolone derivatives. This is another class. Firozolone derivatives, with some exceptions, are no longer widely used in many countries because of their tendency to cause an acute infection known as agranulocytosis, which is also known as agranulosis or granulopenia, which is an acute condition involving a severe and dangerous leukopenia low when the concentrations, when the white blood cell count, it become low. So this condition is called leukopenia and most commonly of neutrophil causing a neutropenia in the circulating blood. So it is a severe lack of one major class of infection fighting white blood cells. Inshallah, in my coming class, I will discuss about the mechanism of action of fire as alone derivatives and other agents.